Software Spring Presence How to use Median in Google Sheets Hello folks! Greetings! Welcome to the tutorial on the Median function. Here is an introduction to Median. Median returns the middle value, from an odd number of values, by sorting the range. Median returns the average of the two middle values, from an even number of values, by sorting the range. Alright, here is the format of the median function. Here's an example. Value 1 is the first range or array, from which you want to get the middle value. Value 2 is optional, and is the second range or array, median should consider to return the middle value. Moving forward, here are the objectives to use the median function. To get the median of an odd number of values. To get the median of an even number of values. To compare the output of median and average functions, for the same data set. Alright. I will type the median formula in this cell. First, type equal to M E. Select median from the menu. For the range, click this cell and shift click this cell. Press enter. Okay, median has automatically sorted the data and returned 238, the middle value from the odd number of values. Now, let's find out the median manually by sorting the data. I will copy this range, by pressing CTRL and C keys, and paste it here, by pressing CTRL and V keys. To sort the data, select the range, and right click on it. Click sort range. Sorting by ascending order, is selected by default. Click sort. Ok, 238 is the middle value in the sorted data. The median function returned the same value, by automatically sorting the data. Going forward, let's find out the median of an even number of values. I will add one more topic, education, with 286 books. I will type the median formula in this cell and specify the range, and press enter. Ok, 248 is now the median value. How did the median function calculate this value? To find out this, let me copy and paste this range, and sort the data again. The median function returned the average of the two middle values as the median. Alright. Let's work on the third and the last objective, which is to compare median and average. First, let's find out the average of this range, the easy way. Select this range. Click this down arrow. Ok, here is the average. Let me type the average header and value. Now, look at this data. Except for the number of books on marketing, all other topics have less than 300 books. So, the average value is not an accurate representation of the data. This is because one value, which is 1279, is much higher than the other values. If some values in a dataset are much different than the others, using the median function would be a better option. Let's take a look at the median value again. This value is telling that, 
50% of the values are below the median, and the remaining 50% are above the median. That's it folks. Thank you for watching this video. Please subscribe to this channel.